Welcome to DTV, I'm with Dave Misson in the lead up to the Round 9 Clash and we'll be going through this week's injury list. Dave, thanks for joining us. Uh, we're going to be running through this week's uh, injury list and uh, I guess the first one is Liam Jara. an update with him. Yeah, look, Liam had scans when we got back to Melbourne on Sunday. Uh, the scan showed obviously no break, uh, no fracture. Um, he's got a, uh, a mild uh, high ankle sprain, so we're looking at you know probably four to six weeks for that, as, as has been reported in the media. Uh, Jordan Gisbert's with his broken jaw. What's an update there? Yeah, look, he's um he's got another week of what we call off legs conditioning, um, and he'll start running probably towards the end of this week, uh, next week. So look, we're hoping three or four weeks he'd be uh, he'd be a chance to return. A few guys have had leg and foot injuries. We've had uh, James Strauss, Neville Jetta and Josh Tynan. Just a bit of an update on those guys. Yeah, both uh, Neville and James Strauss had, went, saw their surgeons last week and had minor operations to, to essentially take the metal work out of their legs that were in there from uh, their original operations. Um, that process is to obviously you know, help them get back uh, to you know, full mobility and, and movement. Um, in Strauss's case, it's pretty minor. Uh, he feels a lot better having those screws taken out of his leg uh, and he'll start running towards the end of the week. Um, Nev's another couple of weeks away from running, uh, but he's out of his boot walking around and, uh, and doing a lot more stuff on his legs. A couple of long-term guys. Uh, Michael Evans has had the back uh, hip problem and, and Max gone with the knee. Um, how are they progressing? Yeah, uh, Evo's looking to run uh, next week on the deloader treadmill. Uh, which is good for him, you know, starting to run again. Gorney started running last week uh, and is moving really well. So he'll, you know, really just go through his rehab running phase uh, and we're looking to get him right for pre-season, obviously.